Alright and gents, one versus you reaction and this is What's the deepest hole we can possibly dig by the channel Real Life Lore? Yeah, this is gonna be fun. This is type of video that Real Life Lore excels at. Real Life Lore channel name should be just, you know, our, uh, our most deepest and most primal desired explained with science. So this is one of the... What is the deepest hole we can possibly dig? That's the that's the thing every kid thinks about whenever they are, you know, I guess what, eight years old or something. So yeah, this is gonna be fun. Remember people, if you like my reaction, do like, subscribe, check out the reaction, there is a link in the description, check out the cast for the playlist, check out the end cards. And this is real life lore video. So you know, if, if it gets blocked, I would put checker box there, I don't know. I don't know what's the pattern there, why some video gets blocked, some not, I don't know. But yeah, let's watch this one. This is a real life lore video made possible by Skillshare, home to 16,000 classes that could teach you a new life skill. The first 500 people to sign up using the link in the description will get a two month free trial. So at some point in their lives, nearly everybody has wanted to dig a hole down to the center of the earth. The only problem is, nobody ever has actually dug a hole down that far. This leads us to the question that this video is all about. If humanity decided that digging a hole was the number one objective of our species, then how deep down could we actually dig with modern day technology? Let's say that we start somewhere on the Earth's surface and just start digging from there. Not too far down at 1.8 meters and we arrive- Alright, before he goes with all his fun facts, uh, let me think with what knowledge I have what's gonna be. I, w I think it would be at best if somebody went really ballistic for some reason and went really deep. I don't think they went any more than 10 miles or something. So most of my viewers are in US and UK, I'm gonna say miles. So I don't think it's gonna be 10 miles or something, more than that. Uh, and as a deepest, I think the center of the earth would be about 4,000 miles uh, deep. Since the diameter is, I think, somewhat 8,000 miles wide, so 4,000 miles deep, nothing can go through uh, the you know core of the Earth because that's more hotter than the surface of the Sun. So anything touching that would get, get vaporized, even the metal. So yeah, uh, so I think as far as I don't think anybody went 10 miles more than that, let alone 100 or even 1,000. That's just ridiculous. So no, I don't think anybody even went close to the center of the Earth arrive at the standard grave depth in western culture, so yeah. if you're afraid of zombies, this is how far down they'll be coming from. Four meters down, and we arrive at the depth that Pharaoh Tutankhamun's tomb was discovered at. A little further at six meters below the surface, we've reached the maximum depth that metal detectors can pick up signals from. At 12 meters, we can find the deepest burrows dug by animals, the Nile Crocodile. A little further- Crocodile digs 40 feet down hole? I had no idea about that crocodiles actually dig holes in the, in, in the ground like that, but 40 feet? That's like about 3-4 story uh, building deep. Damn, okay. We're down at 20 meters and we arrive at the depth of the Paris catacombs beneath ah. the city of Paris. A tomb that holds the remains of over 6 million people. Double that distance it's to creepy, 40 meters though. down and we can see the deepest swimming pool in the world. If you drained this pool and jumped into it from the top, it would take nearly 3 seconds before you would hit the bottom. Hold up there, the deepest swimming pool is 130 feet deep? Why would it be that deep? I mean, what's the reasoning to deep that, you know, dig that deep uh, swimming pool? Okay. 100 meters down is the usual distance that governments bury their nuclear ah. waste at. And just beneath that, at 105.5 meters down, is the deepest metro station in the world, located in Kiev. Moving on to 120... Why is there a 350 feet deep metro station? Wait a minute. Is he taking everything from the sea level? So if, uh, let's say, uh, some place is 300 feet below sea level and their metro is just 46 feet below, but it's still below the sea level, so you consider that as 346 feet below uh, the ground or something? Because that is, if that's not the case, that is really deep metro station there. I mean, obviously, I don't have much experience about metro, but I'm pretty sure metro stations are not that, you know, in deep inside. 
22 meters down, and we see the deepest known oh, that point that a plant's roots have ever reached, a fig tree in South Africa. 220 meters down, and we arrive at the deepest river in the world, the Congo River in Africa. Beyond that, at 240 meters, you can ride through the deepest railway tunnel in the world that connects the Japanese islands of Honshu and Hokkaido. But at 287 meters down, you can drive through the deepest road tunnel in the world in Norway. 305 meters down... Wait a minute, why is in Norway? Again, I think it's just it's that, you know, he's considering below the sea level as it's all below the ground kind of thing. Because 942 feet, 300 meters down, you can drive cars in the tunnel. What tunnels goes that deep and then comes out again? Why, why would you do that? Why would you dig that deep? I don't know. And you would still be vulnerable to the B-82 Earth penetrating nuclear warhead, which ah. can destroy structures up to this depth beneath the surface. Incredibly though, at 392 meters, we arrive at the deepest well and possibly deepest hole ever dug by hand. This is hand. the Wooding Dean water well in the UK, and it was ah. dug all the way back in 1862. At 603 meters down, we arrive at something terrifying, the deepest vertical drop inside of a cave. If you were unfortunate enough to be in this cave and fall down this hole, the fall would be higher up than falling from the top of the One World Trade Center in New York. What in the f That's how deep the hole is inside a cave? How many people mistakenly fell there and nobody even knows about it? 2000 feet below. God damn. And the fall would take you over 11 seconds before hitting the bottom. Even further down though at 700 meters. Yeah, okay. Meters First, I'm pretty sure if you fall down, you're gonna bump along the way. It's not direct hole, I think. 11 seconds before hitting but yeah, the bottom. 11 seconds, that is. Further down, though, at 700 meters, is where the Chilean miners were trapped at for 69 days back in 2010. 970 meters Whoa. down is the deepest hole ever dug that still has an open sky above it, the Bingham Canyon Open Pit Mine in Utah. This pit is so deep that you can ah. place the tallest building in the entire world in the center and still have... Burj Khalifa, Burj Khalifa. Wait, I mean, this is even deeper than that uh, New Mexico asteroid hole. I don't know what the name of that is. The asteroid that took out the dinosaur. There's a massive hole there. This is deeper than that? Damn. That is seriously deep. Look at those small cars there. Okay over 100 more meters to the surface. Much further down at 1,410 meters though is where the deepest concert ever held happened by the band Agonizer in Finland. 1,642 Okay, where did they cap the event again? Deep or there's a mine there or something? ...happened by the band Agonizer in Finland. 1,642 meters down is the depth of the deepest lake on Earth, Lake uh, Baikal in Russia. And 1,857 meters down is the deepest part of the uh, Grand, Canyon. Grand Canyon. The deepest known cave on Earth is located 2,197 meters beneath the surface in Georgia. But the deepest hole that you could actually fall into goes way deeper than even this. All the way down at 3,132 meters is the bottom of the Moab Katsong mineshaft in South Africa. Taking okay. the elevator takes four and a half minutes to reach the bottom, but if you fell into it from the top, it would take you 25 entire seconds for you to hit the bottom and think about what you've just done. Long enough to receive and miss an entire phone call. Even further down... Five minutes just to go down that elevator. Five minutes is a long time when you think about it. I mean, when you travel to elevator, it takes seconds. Imagine five entire minutes just, you know, elevator is just going and just going. You feel like you're in one of the, I guess, in Fallout 4 or something. Your game cannot load up faster, so this elevator just goes and goes. Down at 3,600 meters is the deepest point that a multicellular organism ah. has been found alive. This freaky looking worm. But human beings themselves have been even deeper than this. 4,000 meters down is the deepest part of the deepest mine on Earth also located in South Africa. The trip from the surface down to the bottom takes over an hour to complete, and the temperature at the bottom can reach a sweltering 66 degrees Celsius. 66 degrees Celsius? 
how the hell do people survive i'm an indian we live in hot environment and that just looking at that is just making hell no hell no i would never be in that position how do people survive i'm pretty sure if you go at that uh, temperature below there in just five or ten minutes you start to panic you start to you know lie down start to get dehydrated or something that is way high of a temperature 6,000 meters is the average depth of the oceanic crust beneath the ocean floor. Way down at 8,848 meters is the height of Mount Everest if it were placed underground instead. 10,994 meters down is the bottom of the Marianas Trench, which is the deepest part of the ocean. Yeah. I already covered the depth of the ocean in another video, but unbelievably, humans have actually dug down significantly deeper than even this. Yeah. For reference, about what's next, 11,887 meters is the average altitude that a commercial airliner flies at. But deeper than that, at 12,262 meters is the depth of the Kola Superdeep Borehole, a project where the Soviet Union attempted to drill all the way through the Earth's crust. They only reached a third of the way there, though, because the temperature... All right, I guess 10 miles, but it's 7.6 miles, so it's kind of makes sense, yeah. But still... Soviet Union, of course it's Soviet Union. We're gonna duck through the center of the earth, really? It's... <laughs> oh my god, it's 4,000 miles. They really thought they're gonna dig that deep? Dab. People, I don't know, but there was a real panic once, like people thinking of digging through the earth, entirely through, with, you know, uh, dig through the center of the earth. I don't know, they abandoned the project, but they made this gigantic uh, digging machine or something. People were afraid, like, this is going to cause uh, lots of issues, geographical issues, lots of earthquakes and things. But yeah, I don't think it can be done. That's really deep. How are you going to dig 4,000 miles inside just to reach the core of the earth? At this depth reached 180 degrees Celsius, which was too hot for the drill to continue operating any further. The hole is also only 23 centimeters wide, so luckily you can't accidentally fall into it. If you dropped a... Okay, wait a second. I'm not gonna lie. If I was standing there, just the fact that it's that deep would creep me out. Just knowing that if I open that hatch on the top, it's, it's, the hole's going to be that deep. Just that fact alone is going to creep me out. I don't know why. It's just like, damn, there's a literal... Of course, I'm not going to fall into it, but it's that deep of a hole. ...centimeters wide, so luckily you can't accidentally fall into it. If you dropped a quarter down the shaft, though, it would take about 50 seconds before it ah. hit the bottom. Recently, however, this depth has been surpassed by the Z44 Shavio oil and gas well, which has drilled down of to a course. depth of 12,376 meters. That's the equivalent of stacking 15 Burj Khalifas on top of each other, and currently represents the deepest hole that humanity has ever dug. Ah, okay. The crust, however, can extend down to 70,000 meters below the Earth's surface. Surface, and the planet's center is located 6,371 kilometers oh, there you down. If the I knew it, it's 8,000 diameter, so yeah, 4,000 miles deep. The surface of the Earth is Lisbon, Portugal, and the planet's center is Astana, Kazakhstan, then humanity so far has just ventured this tiny, insignificant distance. A lot of you have asked me before yeah. what software I use to create these videos with and... Yeah, people, go to... Uh, skl.sh follows this r double l and support this channel this is the kind of topic where this channel excels at you know just ridiculous childish topic that even ch ch children thinks of but putting it into the uh, you know in terms of science like is it even possible so yeah <laughs> it was the deepest so, yeah i mean when you think about it the tallest of the tallest structure like mount everest and the deepest of the deepest hole like mariana's trench that's even those two combined it's not that much of a diameter is it compared to the earth's diameter that's why i love when some science i don't know who said that but if there was a cosmic giant that came from the you know space and can just rub the planet like this you know that, that giant wouldn't even feel the you know oceans and mountains because that would be so small it wouldn't even fit the depth of the fingerprint lines so, you know, to the giant, the earth would be smooth as hell. Even the water, they wouldn't even feel water because it would barely wet considering the depth of the ocean. So, yeah. All right. That was the, what's the deepest hole we can possibly dig. 
by the real life lore if you like my reaction don't like and subscribe check out the reaction under this link in the description check out the cast of the playlist check out the end cards and i'll see you next time